Floyd Mayweather's consistent backing for Israel has grown more apparent, following the delivery of several tons of supplies to Israel via his private jet. The boxing legend recently engaged in a video call with a group of Israeli Defense Force, IDF, soldiers who had received the aid. According to a recent TMZ report, Mayweather had a conversation with the IDF's Yahalom unit, a special forces anti-terrorism group, on Monday. During the discussion, Money delivered words of encouragement and motivation to the soldiers as they continued their fight against the Palestinian terror groups. He stated, Time equals, 400 ms, greater than, we only want peace in Israel. Thank you for standing up for your country. Floyd Mayweather addressed the soldiers, who were wearing custom TMTX Israel hats along with their IDF uniforms while keeping their identities hidden, the former boxing. Champion has been actively demonstrating his support for Israel, regularly expressing it through social media platforms. His team also recently conducted a charitable airlift operation to deliver essential supplies to the IDF and civilians, aiming to aid the Jewish state during the escalating conflict with Hamas terrorists in the Middle East. Time equals, 400 ms, greater than Floyd Mayweather also participated in a march to Los Angeles Museum of Tolerance to display his solidarity with Israel. It's worth noting that just this past weekend, a sudden attack by Hamas terrorists tragically claimed the lives of more than 1,200 Israelis, left nearly 3,000 injured, and captured over 150 civilians, Floyd. Mayweather recently expressed his support for the Israeli citizens affected by terror attacks carried out by Hamas and other Palestinian armed groups, including Palestinian Islamic Jihad, PIJ, through an Instagram post. He shared, I stand with Israel against the Hamas terrorists. Hamas do not represent the people of Palestine but are a terrorist group that are attacking innocent lives. I stand for all humans and wish for the safe return of all Americans and Israelis and any human that were kidnapped as hostages during these horrific war crimes. This is not a time for politics. This is a time for safety first and foremost. God bless America. God bless Israel. God bless humankind.